Lime Mud Drying and Preheating with Lime Flash H Technology. The calcination process in the lime cycle is done with the rotating lime kiln, and efficiency of the lime kiln depends on the type of feed head technology used. Andritz has three types of feed head systems, LMD, Lime Flash, and now Andritz has invented the next generation Lime Flash H feed head. This Lime Flash H is a completely new feed end technology in the industry for maximizing efficiencies of the lime kiln, a boost for the lime kiln. Andritz has now developed the successful Lime Flash solution with a focus on further increasing the capacity of lime kilns and at the same time significantly reducing energy consumption. Therefore, this new process called Lime Flash H enables the running of a same size kiln with significantly higher production. This is all without the usual large capital investment. Andritz 2 Cyclone's Lime Flash H system contains the following main components. Dryer feed screw enables lime mud entering into the Lime Flash H system. The first cyclone, called the drying cyclone, separates the dried lime mud from the flue gas. The lime kiln feed head system allows the process to operate at a higher feed end temperature without plugging. The preheating cyclone is the second cyclone, which represents a new feature of the Lime Flash H system, where lime mud is further heated up. Lime mud flows by gravity through the preheating cyclone through a chute to the rotating lime kiln. Here you can see an illustrative process flow of the Lime Flash H feed head system. The flue gas flow coming from the lime kiln, visualized by the blue arrows, enables both drying and heating up the lime mud in a sustainable and environmentally friendly way when mixed together and then separated in the cyclones. The orange arrows show how the lime mud is carried into the process through the two cyclones and then finally entering into the rotating lime kiln. This process represents the next generation lime kilns and is called Andritz Lime Flash H. The dryer feed screw conveys the lime mud coming from the lime mud filter into the flue gas stream, where it is entrained, flash dried, and carried upwards with the flue gas to the drying cyclone. The drying cyclone separates the dried lime mud from the flue gas. The lime mud then flows by gravity through a chute into the preheating feed screw, which feeds the dried mud into the flue gas stream again in the Lime Flash H lime kiln feed end. Lime mud is now further heated to about 500 to 600 degrees Celsius and carried with the flue gas to the preheating cyclone. The preheating cyclone separates the heated lime mud from the flue gas. The calcination process starts and lime mud flows by gravity through a chute entering the rotating lime kiln. Due to the higher temperature of the lime mud entering to the lime kiln, the calcinating process continues with better energy efficiency. This means higher capacity with a shorter lime kiln. The cooled lime kiln flue gases continue after the drying cyclone through an ESP-induced fan and finally enters the atmosphere via the stack. Lime Flash H represents a significantly high capacity increase, at the same time as running with a high efficient and environmentally friendly heat recovery system. Further advantages include the possibility of the lime kiln to operate with a higher feed head temperature, flexibility to operate lime kiln with different process conditions, ensuring excellent availability and minimum maintenance costs. Major investment savings are made as the lime kiln size remains the same, and there are no requirements for civil works. 
Lime Flash H is available for both new lime kilns and for increasing the capacity of existing kilns. In other words, more capacity with less lime kiln.